Okay. Day 12. Is that even right? I, or, I, dude, I don't know. I don't know how to, I don't know. Um, I, not right now. I'm not thinking about it. Okay. <laughs> Day 12, though. Day 12. That's great stuff. Um, okay, so... Yeah, symptoms, uh, yeah, um, so, it's just, again, it's just not, no energy at all, and I got a little something on that too, um, and sleeping is hard, uh, it's really just, dude, it's just, oh man, it's really beating me down, but, again, I mean, it's, again, it's not, it's, that's going to happen anyway, getting off stuff, at least that's been, that's been my experience, experience, like, you know, you still don't sleep, and you, you know, whatever, but I didn't go through, like, the terrible, terrible agony, so, I mean, yes, it was not fun, but it wasn't terrible, so, um, but no, I mean, really, though, like, it's not, I'm just really tired, and foggy, and, and, yeah, depressed, like, it's gloomy feeling, you know, and it's hard to tell too, like, is it because I'm not sleeping too, or like, you know, it kind of, I don't know, it's, 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 I don't know, um, but yeah, so like, you know, I'm just really short of breath, like really, and it got really bad last night, and, um, and, and yeah, when I, when I stand up, dude, you just, like, I've blacked out a few times, that's becoming kind of more, more and more of an issue actually, and last night, so my wife, so she keeps up on my blood pressure and stuff, and, and but my pulse was like 50-something, and then it was under 50 a bunch, like a bunch, and then all of a sudden I had a surge of energy, and it went up to 80 last night, so we kind of, because we're thinking about maybe going to the hospital, because there's some rare, rare things that can happen, it's very rare, I don't even know, um, anyway, I, I, I see a doctor tomorrow, so uh, I'm going to get that checked out, so Cause, cause yeah, dude, you just, there's like, like nothing, nothing in the tank, you know? And, uh, then my wife is like, dude, your pulse was 48. You're, you know, I think it got down to like 44 or something. And, uh, anyway, so, cause yeah, you can have some complications there. So anyway, I don't know. That's just, I don't know. I just, I'm sharing that with you, I guess. (laughs) Um, so, yeah, and I mean, I don't know, I, I, I did eat some oatmeal last night, it's kind of, I know this sounds like a broken record, I, I know, and, and I'm going to try to just make this short, but, um, yeah, I mean, you just don't, you, you, you know, functioning is hard, like, that, that, that's hard to do, it's hard to, to really function and have responsibilities, it would be very, very hard for me to do that, I know I'd be, it, it just, it'd make things, it'd break me down, I'd be crying, and whatever, (laughs) it'd just be so hard, I mean, that's just what you do, that, you know, that's what it does, um, I did have this weird feeling, where I was in the shower, and I just, like, like, the flesh part of me, it was just, like, I just want to feel good, like, it just, like, I had this overwhelming, and I had to really hone that in, actually, I really had to pray, and, um, you know, I'm just so foggy too. I just, I just actually turned on. I listened to the book of Ephesians, to audio. So, um, and that helps. And, and I read, I did read too. But um, anyway, uh, this is yeah, dude. I'm, I'm so tired. I'm just so beat down. You know, but but just real quick. Um, you know, twelve days. You know, that that's awesome. Like that. I had an overwhelming, great feeling. Yeah, I went for a walk. I walked two miles. It was very hard. I thought I might not walk or maybe only walk a mile. Maybe I didn't know, and but I got got going, and I did it, and I just made myself do it, and I, and it did help me feel better. It was very hard getting going today. I got going earlier than yesterday, um, but it is just, it's very hard. It's just, you're very, very, oh, you're just so exhausted. I mean, I don't know. I mean, yeah you know, you're not sleeping and then you have other stuff going on. You're not producing things in your body. So you're, you're not sleeping and you're not, you know, so it's like this double whammy, hammy tammy. So I don't know, whatever. Um, but, uh, I had this great feeling of like, I'm 12 days clean and I, I am not a slave to Suboxone right now. Like that, dude, that was a, like, seriously, 
that was really a great feeling as I was walking. I was like, oh, you know what? Like, it was the first time it really, it's like, I'm not a slave. I am not a slave to Suboxone right now. So that is, that is a V for victory. Like, really, that is awesome stuff. Like, um, if you're, you know, if you're 12 days clean and stuff like that, that's awesome, dude. And like, seriously, like the Bible, obviously, I mean, people that know the Bible, some like talks about being a slave and how the, fl- the Bible talks about the flesh and the spirit are at war with each other. Okay. Paul writes of that. And, and, but, but you are, a, you know, and I know I'm using this because right now, like too, like with me, like, yeah, like if I go back to Subox and like, that is sin to me, God's put it in my heart. Like it's sin to me, to me in my heart. Okay. Um, but you know, G, you know, you know, Paul wrote, wrote, you know, in Galatians, I think, yeah, it was, it was in Galatians about how, you know, it was for freedom that Christ set us free from this yoke of slavery. And you know what I mean? Like it, it, it you know, Christ did the, did things to get this spirit in us so we could overcome things. And, you know, Christ, you know, Jesus was talking to the Jews and, you know, and they're going, kind of going back and forth with the Pharisees and, and stuff. And, and, uh, uh, you know, they're talking about their lineage, you know, like, oh, we're sons of Abraham and, and, uh, and whatever. And, and, uh, we're, we're not, you know, we're not, a, we're not, yeah, we're not, we haven't, we're not a slave to anyone and da, 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 and, you know, cause they're, Jesus is kind of talking to him about that and stuff. I know I'm not making this very good, but, um, but, uh, oh man, it's so hard for me to keep my thoughts right now, you guys. Um, but, but anyway, Jesus says to them, anyone who sins is a slave to sin. So he was trying to make a point. Like I'm not, there's no partiality in God. God's not racist. You're not just a Jew and you punch your ticket and you go like, no, actually a lot of the people that were persecuting the Christians were Jews in the early, you know, the early church was a Jewish church, you know? So anyway, but, um, it was persecuted by Jews in Jerusalem and all the surrounding areas. So anyway, sorry, I don't know why that matters, but <laughs> it doesn't matter actually. But, uh, but yeah, so I guess what I'm saying is just that, that slate, like you're not a slave and, and, and there's so much more in the Bible. I can't even, you know, my mind just isn't even, it's not firing good at all right now, actually. Um, keep praying for me guys. Keep praying for me. This wasn't a great video. This was just like real, like, I'm just, I'm getting beat down you guys. Um, but I'm not losing. That's the thing. Like let, let it beat me down. I'm, it's going to beat me down. Like it's going to, you know, let it just whatever, like I'll take it, you know, I, I deserve it. Um, you know, so, um, I, I made this bed and now I got to sleep in it. So what's up? So anyway, but yeah, keep praying, keep praying. And, uh, yeah, let's just all like, I don't know. I don't know. Let's just be good people. Right. So love the Lord, seek the Lord, seek truth. Okay. Go seek truth. Okay. All right. Thank you. Love you guys. And God bless and salute.